Welcome back everybody, I am here with X-Jack XV, or we call him Jack. And uh, basically he's got this beautiful four-legged mecha to show me. Which is terrifying, to be perfectly honest. Are you here, Jack? I am here. <laughs> tell By the me, way, to me. Tell me all about it, my friend. Yeah, I, I just take inspiration from like other four-legged mechs I see. Like this one just, I was like, oh, that looks so much like a tank. I really yeah. want to make that one with three cannons in the front. <laughs> and I think I think it did a nice job just uh, putting, making it look how I want it to look. It may not have as much damage as it probably should have put, but it's more of like a vehicle destroyer than a ship destroyer. It's really inspiring when you see people do stuff like this because it's very complicated. I'm just going to get right close up on some of the joinings here. Something which you got to really take a peg at, because look at this. Look at the joining with the wedges. This must have taken you quite a while, right? Just it did, but I I was on a... I, I was not at home, so you I had, had a, a lot bit, of time on my hands. You had a lot of time to kill, yeah. Well, it's constructive use of time, and I'm sure a lot of people are going to be looking at this and thinking they can do something similar, so it's going to be nice and inspiring for people who want to use detail in this way. I kind of like a make it does make it look like you've got linkage in there, which is very nice. I try putting the hardest in the joints. <laughs> that was the first thing I noticed. I mean, obviously, there's a hell of a lot of detail all over it, but um, it's a really nice use of wedging basically just to give that contour when you're zoomed out. The legs are really nice as well, they remind me of something. It's probably off of some mecha that I've seen and. Uh, like the plating over from the knee down to the feet, you know? It's kind yeah. Of cool. <clears throat> I'm sure you've seen it in a lot of places, especially if you watch Gundam. Mm-hmm. So there it is. Look at that turret. Very nice turret. Can you sit? You can stand in that. Right, hang on a second. I love these. You get extra credit, mate, for that. Hang on. Yeah, I mean, it's not really too standable. <laughs> no, I'll, no, no, but, no, but come on, look. Here I am. More ducker! <laughs> <laughs> That's epic. Go on, stand in it, buddy. Whoa! Yeah, I mean, I, <laughs> I don't understand how you were. It's because I'm flying, it. aren't I? Yep. Uh, yeah, I'm in gravity, <laughs> so I just fall in. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's beautiful. But, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Okay, okay. Sorry, okay. I fall. <laughs> Get away! I got yeah. the little top hatch over here. Yeah, yeah, it's really nice. It's a really nice looking turret. Very nice indeed. So, is there an interior or is it just a core room? No, there, there is an interior. There is an interior. Okay, so I'm coming in the back. Got storage and a corridor. And there's, there's a gravity on the side. It's all good, I'm in build mode. Straight into the core room with a lovely bridge design. What do you know about chairs? There you have it. Just this is another chair design number five of tonight. So very nice, very nice. This is this is kind of how I build my chairs actually. Um, I did it in my world eater yeah, in the briefing room. So yeah, that's very cool. I really like it. I like it. Oh, we're going this way. Okay. So we'll follow you down this corridor. Up, let's go up the stairs. Oh, you're up. Up the stairs, up the stairs. Yep. Oh, wow, and you just come out the top here. To yep. The, to the turret. Yeah, usually what I do for the back is I actually make the back the entrance. So I'll put like an elevator or something going up from a planet and just put it right into the back. Yeah. Put troops in. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> It's really cool. I've quite a few I'm loving the concept. I'm loving the concept for this. It's great. I do I do have a whole sector though of ships. I've been trying to get in some of them. I know I missed last week's. <laughs> ah well, we'll be doing sector reviews in the point one very soon, so make sure that you've just like bug me. Just bug me. And uh, bug me when I'm online and it'll get done. Okay. So what's the name of this, Beauty? This is the Wartress Fortress. The what? The Wartress Fortress. The Wartress Fortress. And your name is? X-Jack XV. 
Very nice. So thanks very much for coming along to the lineup review. Oops, someone just bumped me. Thank and, you, Tom. Uh, yeah, and uh, thanks to everybody watching. So yeah, I'm going to be moving on to the next one in the review now. I don't know what it is. Oh so, God, uh, boss. Try to stay on. <laughs> um, it looks like it might be something large. So I will be seeing you in the next one. Thanks very much.